We are in the Parkstadt Limburg region and I am standing in the Expo building as part of a very unique project, Super Local. And today we're going to focus on the Super Circular Estate. Let's see how it all began. Extra productie te verkrijgen. Op de eerste vrije zaterdag bereikten de gezamenlijke mijnen in Limburg een productie van 35.400 ton. Dat is ongeveer 1600 spoorwagons. Zo werken de mijnen en de spoorwegen samen om op korte termijn verlichting te brengen in de moeilijke situatie van de kolenvoorziening in ons land. Ter ere van de kompels nu werd in de oude mijnstad Kerkrade een monument opgericht dat deze dagen The area was known for its coal mines. The population grew and there was a high demand of living spaces. Four big flats were built on this area. But in the 70s the mines closed. En er ging besloten dat met ingang van 1 april 1966 de mijn Margaret zou worden afgebouwd waarbij een betrekkelijk korte termijn van drie jaar zal worden nagestreven. The closing of the mines led to a big decrease of jobs in the area. Lots of people ended up leaving the area. And in the next 30 years, the Parkstadt Limburg region population will shrink by 27% due to population aging, but also young people moving to the urban agglomerations such as Amsterdam and Rotterdam, the big cities. This implies that less housing accommodation will be demanded in the following decades in this region. It also resulted in the four big flats ending up on a demolition list. In 2012, the first flat was demolished. However, Housing Association Heim Woden noticed that while demolishing not only a building hosting apartments with a good layout are lost, but also memories and social structures. Heim Woden wanted to reuse these values and qualities. And together with Iba Parkstad and with the city of Kerkrade, they searched for a solution. And that's how Superlocal was born. The idea behind Superlocal is slow, less, local, meaning the opposite of the usual fast building approach, so consciously taking the time to build something with local elements. The Superlocal project wanted to experiment with circular building, reusing existing qualities, materials and values from the project area for the realization of a new estate for about 130 households. To realize such a big ambition, the partners needed to experiment with the materials on site. And the first results of this project were seen here in this area, the Expo building. Super Local officially became an IBA project. A lot of attention was drawn to the project nationally as well as internationally, and particularly in Europe. The Super Local project received a 4.7 million Urban Innovative Actions subsidy. And this is how the Super Circular Estate started. The 12 partners, together with the neighborhood steering platform, explored and experimented with building an innovative and circular area. Now the unique project really started. One of the biggest cranes of the Netherlands lifted three units out of the flats. One of these experiments is the build of three circular test living spaces named Phoenix 3, with the main goal to use at least 90% of reused materials and adding new bio-based materials. Different techniques were used. For example, the base of two out of three of those living spaces were units that were lift out of the flats, but also one-on-one -on -one recycling, for example, usable kitchens that were used for other living spaces, and also on-site renewing of materials, such as concrete. One of the new techniques that was developed on-site in this project is recycled concrete. 
Demolition contractor Dusseldorp invented a way to use the concrete from the existing building, shredding it to sand and cement, and then processing it to recycle green concrete. However, it's not only about materials. Superlocal keeps in mind the importance of the water cycle. It's the project's ambition to store and filter as lot of rainwater as possible for its users. And this cycle was made possible in collaboration with VML and VBL. The plans for this area were made in close collaboration with the people living next to the project, represented in the neighborhood steering platform. Uh, we zijn nu bij het deelproject uh, de gesloten waterkringloop, samen met een aantal organisaties die zorgen voor levering van het water en zuivering van het water, het consumentenwater, uh, kijken we of we nieuwe systemen kunnen introduceren. Uh, dat komt een beetje ook vanuit de energiewereld. Iedereen kent de zonnepanelen en het zelf opwekken van de energie. Um, we zijn het onderzoeken of dat ook op watergebied kan. En we willen kijken of we dat circulair kunnen maken. Conform de wet, of de taak van de gemeente, is afvalwater in te zamelen. En vroeger was er ook nog, dan nemen we het regenwater ook wel mee en dat hebben we allemaal in een buis gepropt. En dat heeft er tot geresulteerd dat de gemeente Kerkrade inmiddels 240 kilometer rionering liggen. En dat is dan grotendeels gemengd water. En net dat gemengde water, dat levert eh, hoge kosten op, dat er overlast voor de mensen ontstaan. Dus we willen terug naar een systeem waar eh, het regenwater niet, in ieder geval niet meer in een buis zit. Ideaal is uh, uiteraard uh, dat er ook drinkwater lokaal gemaakt wordt, uh, maar ook, en dat is voor ons heel van belang, het is een wijk zoals er wel meer zijn in Limburg. Uh, sociale huurwoningen die ook uh, in, een, in een herontwikkelingsgebied. Dus wij verwachten met de kennis die we hier opdoen en met de bevindingen die hier uh, ontstaan, ook wat kunnen zeggen over hoe vaker, hoe gaat dit nou uh, in de toekomst? Uh, gaat dit inderdaad meer uh, voorkomen in Limburg? En zo ja, hoe gaan wij daarop reageren? So from the Expo building to Phoenix Street, further development started. 15 circular ground-based houses were built. And one of the experiences from earlier developments are the floors and the walls that were made out of materials that were released during the flat's demolition. Next to the ground-based houses, there's also room for a high-rise building. Half of this flat will be demolished and rebuilt, and the other half will be left with its frame and renovated. The building has an iconic meaning behind it, which is why its design is being enhanced. Superlocal also focuses on social circularity. On the ground floor there will be a social area for its residents, where they can organize events and meet each other, as the area has the goal to maintain the previous social aspect of this region. A lot of lessons learned, yet still more to come. The first residents are stated in the area as part of the Super Circular Estate project. We look forward to continue the build of the most innovative and circular area for our future generations.